Hello you guys and welcome back to Sweet Tea Cup. <clears throat> okay you guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Put on your goddamn notification. Cause shit is lit and fucking hot over here. You guys, make sure you get a video, a fucking thumbs up, like all my goddamn videos. They're waiting on you. Just hit that goddamn, hit that view button. And you got, <clears throat> make sure you tell your friends, your family, to every goddamn body. Out here in these YouTube streets about what the fuck going on out here. And you guys, make sure you leave a comment because I do like all comments. Now, let's just get into this shit. Now, first, I want to start off. I want to give a shout out. To BSC TV. Let me tell you, y'all sleeping on y'all are sleeping on BSC TV. Cause let me tell you, he is putting the shit out there. And like I said, he dropped a short video. An audio of dumbass kicking the Roy family out of his <clears throat> used to be rented ass house. Now, logically, I'm going to read because I wrote it down. Almost word for word, but you know I put my own little fucking word in because you know how fucking grandma go. Don't fucking come for me. And I don't give a damn. You want to bring your ass over here? Bring your ass over here. But make sure you subscribe to the goddamn channel and leave a goddamn comment. Okay. So, logically, in the video... He was in there whining and crying. And let me tell you something. Forget a bitch. He cried worse than a bitch. Even a bitches, we don't cry like that. And I'm going to keep that shit on period. In the recording, <clears throat> dumbass stated, now this is what he said. I hate all of you all. I want you all to get out. He don't want no fucking beef. <clears throat> he don't want to talk about no fucking view. It don't matter about nothing. I don't want you all here. There is no love in this house. Straight negativity. Straight negativity. I hate all of you guys. Get out. I thought dumbass stated that he loved all the fucking kids so much. I thought he loved the royal kids, you guys. Make this shit make sense. Like I say, his own mouth going to be his goddamn downfall every time. What fucking judge, what fucking judge is going to give dumbass fucking custody of them damn twins? You kick the babies out. You kicked out royalty and the royal kids. You kicked them out and made them homeless. But yet, you want to blame a young, innocent teen girl, Jaleel. Remember the video he said because I want to ask them to leave. <clears throat> because Jaleel to my, well, kick us out. They said, you're a fucking liar. You just on the record. Boy, you a fucking liar. I hope them fucking crown eaters, paint drinkers, Finger, finger paint, painting in fucking Utah. Miniature armies. I dare your whole They got somewhere for you to lay your goddamn head. Because, baby, when you go to court, the judge going to eat your ass up. Don't you know, dummy, that when there's a situation between a man and a woman, especially when they share the house, and you can say the shit you want to say. Because at the end of the day, the judge is going to know. They was in the video. The judge going to know that they helped make that money too. So that was not your shit by yourself. That's where you're going to get fucked up. That's where you fucked up and fumbled the ball again. Because when you go to fucking court, not only are you going to pay child support, not judge going to make you pay restitution, dumbass, to all them fucking videos that you running and get money from. They will be getting the cut now because the judge is going to see to it. Or he going to make you take that shit down and then maybe he'll let royalty run that shit on her shit. Don't fucking come at me. But bring your ass on over here because I'm in the fuck, 
motherfucking state of Florida. Anyone you motherfuckers want to bring your ass here. See what the fuck we got here in fucking Florida. Fucking play with me if you fucking want to. Because this the shit that I was talking about. Now, I want to talk about that little dumbass. And like I said, we're going to call him fucking Gator. <clears throat> and Gator is his video editor. You know, the one that's supposed to edit his fucking video, his homeboy. Come from fucking ass Gary, Indiana. Looking like a fucking minister of fucking society. Allegedly, I know damn well Gator isn't trying to shade and threaten my baby girl royalty. You stay the ugly ass Gator ass. Talking about you was in the house. You know the house. You know what's going on. You know you act like a bitch. Like I said, you act like a bitch. You act like the fucking side chick. I don't give a damn. I don't give a fuck what you don't like. What the fuck would I say? You can kiss my 59-year-old ass. You and dumbass. So I don't give a goddamn about what you say. If you make a fucking video, you get on fucking YouTube, I'm going to fuck with you. If you don't want to be fucked with, then stay in your own little fucking ass corner. I always knew. I said from day one in my fucking video, when people was out there, oh, not Dido, I love Dido. I said, fuck Dido. I don't like him. Something about him. So, and now they talk about getting away free shoes. Didn't I just do a video? You guys, did I not just do a video? After the same day he dropped his video, dumbass, allegedly stating that his shoes was on sale now, they're $175. I did a video late, late that night and stated that why don't your ass and your damn wannabe mafia, mafia team group business partners, I said, why don't you all give away free shoes? But I dared you. I said, give away a hundred pair. But isn't it amazing how they can say they want to give away shoes? Like I said, you know what? They, they, he ain't got no fucking content. You come to my fucking channel. I know you do. I know you listen to my shit. You got somebody that's probably old mess ass man. Hey, old mess ass man, trash ass bitch. Since you like to listen to every goddamn thing. Or maybe it's your bomb ass, abandoned ass, drunken, mess ass mama. Or whoever the fuck. Or maybe it's that fucking body girl. Fucking PRP. And what kind of shit is that? I'm going to touch on that a little bit. You know, you keep talking about, ain't nobody jealous of you. What the fuck would you want to be jealous of you for? You look like a fucking clown. You act like a fucking clown. And the reason why I fucking come for you, because you don't give a fuck what you do to royalty, which will hinder her fucking children. See, nobody come fucking with you about you and your fucking little goddamn kid. So you better get your ass somewhere and settle your goddamn bottle sign, holding, begging ass to buy a fucking hookah ass somewhere and sit down and shut the fuck up. Because you're talking stupid. You damn carpet muncher eater. And I don't give a damn about you, your fucking baby mama, Mimi, all the motherfuckers. Y'all can kiss my ass. Because y'all sitting around here with no money. You ain't got shit to do. And you only went on Tasha, whatever the fuck her name. I don't give a fuck about her need. That bitch don't pay my bill. I don't give a goddamn. Y'all only did that mess ass interview because y'all trying to bring royalty, royalty out the bushes. Because Tasha K got mad that royalty wouldn't do a video with her. Fuck Tasha K. The bitch just another bitch on fucking YouTube that just happened to get lucky and got some fucking view. Bitch, you ain't no real talk hoe. Where your fucking TV show? Fuck you. And that's the only reason you put Nike on that being fucking messy. Your ass are messy. And like I say, you all feel that P 
PRP could get up under her fucking skin. But listen, Roy Child ready to whoop that ass. I don't give a damn. Yeah, I said that she whooped that ass. She mellow whooped the fuck out of her. Because Roy was throwing fucking hands. Say the shit what you want to say. At the end of the day, when Roy had you, Roy was throwing fucking punches. All you did was just grab her by her jacket and Roy and you slung her because of the fucking jacket. But Roy was throwing them goddamn hands. And you took that goddamn ass whooping that you deserve. Because you should have kept your regular ass up there in Gary, Indiana. Alright. I've been fucking waiting. And I'll tell you, I've been waiting on gay ass to talk about that dumb shit. You guys... Let me tell you something. Crack kills babies every day. Because you know him and dumbass and gay, they like fucking crackheads. The shit they say is stupid. Lying ass. A snake and a gator. Mm -mm -mm. Two of a fucking kind. You know that goddamn, you know that movie called Jungle Fever? Made in 1991. This your fucking homework on this video. Look up the movie called Jungle Fever. Wesley Snipe played in it. Samuel L. Jackson in 1999. That's who Gator remind me of. Nigga, you look like him. In it. You look like Gator that was hooked. Don't fucking cry. Yes, I fucking said it. Dumbass and Gator are mad and jealous. If any man takes up for royalty and her kids. You sound like a goddamn fool speaking on another man, telling the man, oh, you should be for the man. That sound like some gay shit. Why would some man want to be taking up other men? First of all, let's get this understood. You're not fucking men. You're dumb asses. You're fucking little boys. You want to live off a single woman and her five damn kids. That's what you want to do. You want to make videos off a single woman and her damn five kids. You know what, Gator? You ain't shit. You came here with shit too. With nothing. And y'all both, I promise you, both of y'all ass going to go back to Indiana where your ass belong with nothing. The same way you walked into Las Vegas is how your fucking ass going to walk out. This is 2023, and things are changing. And there's another man taking up for her. And I hope another one, and another one, and another one, because it's going to show the fucking cowards that y'all are. Y'all love to come for women, but please come for me, because I will cuss you the fuck out. Do what you want to do. They are totally two idiots attacking, bashing, threatening a single mother with five kids. All because of the money. And, and let me explain that shit about the $6,000 that dumb. See, dumb man thinks he's so fucking smart. But like I keep telling you, my baby girl, she got a godmama. That's fucking me. And I ain't one to reckon with, baby. I am something to reckon with. I'm not one to play with. So let me break this shit down for y'all little motherfuckers. I like y'all don't understand the $6,000 situation. Once dumbass allegedly, let me use that word first. Because I'm going to say, I'm going to put this shit out here. You all need to know. Once dumbass realized that my baby girl, my goddaughter royalty was ignoring the fuck out of him. She wasn't answering his phone calls. She had on block. She wasn't, hey, come out of his fucking mouth. Don't fucking hate on me. She wasn't answering his text. So what he did, because somebody, like I say, I don't know who keep telling you how to write your fucking script, boy. But they ain't got shit over me. So he decided he's going to do a bunch of texts on his phone. And that's why he put in the text, oh, um, you're going to let me see the kids. I could give you <clears throat> whatever what you want. I could give you the 6000 He did that on purpose because he knew baby girl was not answering him. So then when he come in and do a video, he can say, see, see, this, she want me to pay her $6,000. But you know, but Roger never responded to you. Y'all got to be some dumb ass motherfuckers. To keep listening to any damn thing that this dumb ass man child say. You only saw a conversation within his crazy ass self. All those texts were just with him. 
And the reason why she never responded is the same simple reason why this shit was happening now. Because he flipped everything around. But he only flipped it with people that he thinks stupid. People, people that he thinks is not educated. People that he thinks ain't wise enough, ain't been here. But God, mom, I've been here a long time, baby. Way before your ass was even thought about, thought about. Way before your mama fucked up and had you by fucking mistake. Because I don't know what the fuck going on with that. You did those texts because you want to show on YouTube. I always say when dumbass went to YouTube first, he's lying. Remember that, you guys. Because you only want to show that you offer her $6,000. But Roy never said shit to you. She never responded back to you. There's no text coming from Royalty saying, okay, yes, give me $6,000. Meet me on the part. The only shit you got are texts that you input it into your fucking phone and try to send it to her. That's all that you have. I can't wait till she take your trifling ass to court. Because, boy, you just hung your damn self. You had a whole conversation with yourself. You crazy as fuck. So that's how those $6,000 go. Royalty ain't never asked him for nothing. Royalty left with the clothes on her fucking back and the kids. She took nothing with her. See, real intelligent people, the jury, and the judge, they are going to know how to dissect this shit the right way. They gonna know. A bitch that's money hungry don't leave everything. A bitch that's money hungry don't go run to the judge as soon as she can to get money. She just wanted her space and her fucking freedom to live her life. Because she been tormented for nine years. For nine years, he have constantly kicked them out of the rented houses over and over. He have belittled them, bashed them, emotionally, verbally, or bruised her children. Verbally. It's in the fucking video. He told them he hate them. He told them they was negative. He told them he don't want to see nobody. He told them to get the fuck out. And the judge is going to penalize him for that. Because you kicked a single woman out and your two twin babies and her three kids when they helped made that money for those videos. And you didn't give a damn that you made them homeless. And then you had the nerve to talk shit about because her mama opened the doors for them. You a low down dirty ass. You know you the worst kind of snake. You like one of them motherfuckers, one of them anacondas. You the worst kind. And you guys, I'm out of this shit.